Hello and welcome to the second episode of Little Witch in the Woods. Last we left off, we were making our way to the village. Um, and we had talked to a lady who seemed cursed, and so we were going to make some cursed candy um, to lift the curse. So we're going to go down to the workplace, and we're going to see if we can find a recipe or something down here that can help me. So we're going to be opening our encyclopedia. There we go. Oh, here. <laughs> Brilliant. Um, set fire to stage... Three, stir the ladle, don't stir. Pour in the right vessel. Okay, easy enough. Back down. Don't stir. Three, this, ah, 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 and that. Okay, I think I got it. Yay! Um, so I just give this lady the, what the what is this? Hello? No, I can't draw that. One of my missions is draw with my quill. And I have not run into anything to draw in way too long. What the? No, I'm just gonna not even approach that. They look like they want to hurt me. So, yeah. Would you like to try this? May the blessings of nature be with you. Hello? Yes, hello? Am I speaking properly now? Yes, I think so. Wow, thank you so much. To hell with nature. Well, not exactly. Oh, did you come to this town to be an apprentice? I was on a train, but I got off for a moment and it left without me. Oh dear. I was about to enter the town, but it's blocked off by some prickly vines. Damn, nature. Thankfully... We found an empty witch's house nearby, so I've been staying there. An empty... Oh! Oh, yes, there is a witch's house here. Th that's good. I've business in the village, too, but the vines stop me. Nature be damned. I'll be here for a while, so let me know if you need anything. Oh, then can I ask you a favor? Not a favor, but a fair price. What do you need? The tools were broken when I was trying to use the dispensary at the witch's house. Do you have any tools or parts? What kind of tools or parts do you need? I need a glass bottle for the extractor and a roaster handle for winding the roaster. Wait a minute. I'll look for them. Sure. But Ellie, do you have any money? I do. Mom gave me pocket money when I came out. You think you'll be able to buy witch tools with just enough pocket money to buy a snack or two? Oh, is that so? What if I don't have enough money? Since you have tools, make and sell potions or something. You can also sell candies now. Only if there are people to buy them. I found it. Take this. Yes! A glass extractor bottle. How much is this? Oh, never mind. This is return for breaking my curse. Wow, thank God. Unfortunately, I don't have any roaster handles for the roaster. I see. Will you be staying at the village? If so, I'll, I'll bring it next time. I'll sell it at a proper price then, however. Good. Please bring it then. Okay. I'll write roaster handle in the memo. Oh, and take this too. Yes. Since the price for the bottle earlier wasn't enough, I'll give this to you as well. Thank you. Sure, come back next time. Now we'll be able to fix the extractor. But are you really going to stay in this village? I should, until the train comes. Really? I have no choice. No, I mean, are you really going to leave when the train comes? That... I'll decide when that happens. Let's just fix the extractor first. This guy looks like he's gonna try and attack me, and I'm, I'm not ready for that kind of... I'll just run straight home. Uh-oh, he's blocking my house. 
no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Run, 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 run. Oh goodness. I don't know how I'm supposed to fight somebody in this game. Um, so I just pop the bottle on here. There you go. Should I use the glass bottle I have for the extractor? Yeah. Good, now I can use the extractor. We can finally make potions properly. Yay! Then what do I do now? Didn't you want to go to the village? You should remove the gigantic prickly vine. That's true, but it seems impossible to get rid of that huge thing with the recipe I have now. The basic recipe does seem kind of inadequate. What's your plan? Now that the extractor has been fixed, you'll be able to make potions from the basic recipes. If you make Weed Terminator Potion, you can get rid of Little Honey Pumpkin. I'll be able to go to the places that have been blocked. A little more, yeah. So the forest... Let's look through the forest. There must be something. What did I need for the... Oh. I don't think I have any of that. So I don't have any squishy cup for use. Okay, now I got it. A mint flavor candy for kids. <laughs> Be sure to store it on a high shelf in a tin can since it is addictive. Oh, okay. I can make a couple of these. I'll make a couple of those. Four. Okay, so... Um, fire stage four, ladle right... Pour in the right vessel. Okay. So, this, this, four, and this way. Yes. I wonder what happens if you get something wrong. Oh, is it nighttime? Let me run around. Uh, oh, jeez. My god. A crow? Witch! It spoke? It's a witch's crow. Oh, it's a, a witch's crow. Goods and services! Goods and services! Witch's catalog! The witch's catalog? I've always wanted to try it out. You need to head towards High Lion, young lady. But I can't just starve until I reach the village. After I find the village, I'm going to make sure I try it out before I go to High Lion. Limited time only! Register now for a gift! Ha! Try the witch's catalog! Try the witch's catalog! They're handing out gifts as well! Plus, it's limited time only! Gift! Multi-purpose glue? Kitchen accessories? A spork? In any case, I need the witch's catalog. I guess it wouldn't hurt to have in a pinch. You can buy ingredients or potion recipes from them. Alright! Let's register for now. Thank you. Thank you. It's a little late. I'm kind of... I, I, I don't think it's a great idea to be out here. Can I draw this guy? Or is he going to try... Circle, 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 Yes, don't touch me, for the love of God. Oh, 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 the bunnies. I just grab them? Oh, fuck. Frick yeah. Oh, it's night. Darn it. Think they're still there? What do these guys do? Wait. It loves to play, so it'll try and play hide and seek if you attempt to collect from them. Try to remove all the vines wrapped around if you're curious about its true appearance. Okay. I'll go up and grab one. No, 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 no. Come back. Oh, if I throw, like, the... The, what's the word I'm like? If I throw the, um, oh, light off. <laughs> uh, oh, they're all back on again. That's lame. What is, okay, wait. Oh, no, you're right here. Silver star bell. Oh, I need a, a net for a plant? It's right there. It's not going to run anywhere. Um, I'll just go to sleep. Run out and get, I'm going to go grab a bunny. Let me quickly run, run, you hit the run button. <laughs> um, 
So they're not bunnies, my bad. I've been referring to them incorrectly. They are squishy cubs. Um, let me make some extract. Um, set fire to stage four. Don't stir. Okay, I got it. Bonk, bonk. Um, four, don't stir. Press and hold to craft. Cool. Make another one. Might as well. Alright. I'm going to pop this in here. Move all this in here. This in here. Got healing candy and crap. Okay, we're good. Oh, there's something in this bush. Draw with a quill. Draw. Oh, there we go. How many things have I drawn? I think it's been a couple. Oh no, bush bug. I need, okay, a net for that. <laughs> Which I don't have. Virgil, look at that. The birds? It's grown so much. It wasn't that big a while ago. That must be an adult honey pumpkin. We better get rid of it before it grows anymore. What? I'm not even a gardener, why? We must get rid of it to get to a new place since we haven't been uh, behind there. Oh, I guess it can't be helped to get to the new place. I guess I should make weed terminator potion. I already did. Oh, collect the ingredients, process them, and make try making a potion. And if there's anything you don't know, try using the quill in the encyclopedia. It's simple because I've made it once before. Don't forget to remove the nucleus if you want to avoid repeating the same thing. Oh. Yes! I did it! And I throw. Goodness. What's this guy? Can I draw this guy over here on the little web? No? Okay, good talk. I might as well just keep grabbing these guys whenever I can. You can never have too many healing items, that's what I always say. Oh, are those bars? Uh, what? Oh. What? Oh, it's a ramp. Hello. You okay? Wow, Virgil. There's someone stuck in the spider web. I think he's lost consciousness. Is he even alive? Oh my gosh. I don't know. Um. Ah. Oh, they woke up. <laughs> Who? I'm Ellie. I'm an apprentice witch. A witch? Wow, this is my first time seeing an apprentice witch. It's my first time seeing someone caught in the spider web. <laughs> my name is Rubrum. Rubrum. I live in the village with my grandma, but now I'm stuck in a big spider web. He doesn't seem to understand the gravity of his situation. A big spider web means there's a big spider nearby. <gasps> you be quiet. Don't worry, you'll be fine. I'll help you down. You have to be careful when dealing with spider webs, Ellie. It looks pretty strong, but one wrong move and you'll get stuck in it yourself. Then, what do I do? Maple herb works best against insects. Good, I got the maple herb. Let's go back to rubber now. Okay. I'm, I'm coming! I'm coming, little fox buddy! I don't know. I feel like I should trust him, but the fact that he's a fox and this is like a, a witch game makes me feel like I can't trust him. But I, tr I trust I trust this guy. I trust him, I think. Like this. Oh! Are you okay? Yeah, probably. Can you walk? Okay. Then let's go to the witch's house together. Okay, come on. You don't want to open this little gate for me? No? No gate? Oh, key. Uh, come on, catch up. You're going too slow, little guy. Oh. Oh, the mission is... Where the... Whoa, he's walking fast. I should go check on what happened. Are you okay? Are you hurt? I can't walk because my legs hurt. You were probably up there for too long. Then I'll give you a hug. 
I'll give you treatment at the witch's house. Okay. <laughs> I can't run? Upsetting. How do I get home? I don't- wait, I don't know how to get home. Okay. And then I go this way. Our village is just a little further from here. But you can't pass through now because of the prickly vines. Let's go to the witch's house for now and find a way. Yeah. You know what? I think I misjudged the fox guy. I think that I might have been, um, a little mean. So, we're here. Wow, a witch's house. Thanks. Okay, welcome in. I have to hurry up and get back to the village. If not, Grandma will scold me. Okay, leave it to me. I'll get rid of that huge prickly vine. Whoa, really? I'll make sure to get you back to your village. Don't worry. Okay, thanks. So, how did you get caught in the spider web? I just came to the forest to play for a little bit. But time flew by, and by then the gigantic prickly vines were covering the way. Then I found a treasure map and got caught in a spider web as I was trying to pick it up. A treasure map? I saw a picture of a skeleton through the bushes. I saw it in a children's book that it's a sign of pirates leaving their treasures. Shall we go check? What about the gigantic prickly vine? Oh well, we can't do much about it yet. It wouldn't hurt to try. Let's go. Is he following me still? No? Okay, I thought he was gonna- f Oh, is he? Yeah. <laughs> he peeked around the corner. What's this? A boom potion! I even went to a hidden library because I wanted to make it. I'm so lucky to find this here. They don't normally use a skeleton design of a sim as a symbol of luck, right? The important thing now is that I have something to blow things up with! And also, something to blow up. <laughs> You're super excited. Then, shall we go try it right away? Um, yeah, sure. Oh. Oh! I thought we were gonna blow up the gate. <laughs> I miss this feeling. Sometimes it takes boldness to overcome a crisis. Don't you think it's strange that a boom potion was dropped in that secluded forest? Someone might have hidden it thinking that it's treasure like Rubrum. Ugh, I don't know. The important thing now is that the boom potion is in my hands. Go, boom potion! Oh, shoot. Wow, it won't even budge. It must be stronger than the secret door in the principal's office. What are these fragments coming out of it? Look at this, Virgil! It's a prickly vine fragment! It seems to have worked a little bit. But the vines appear to have grown back pretty fast. We might be able to figure out exactly what these prickly vines are. These prickly vines aren't even in the codex. How are you going to figure that out? Hmm, well... Oh, wouldn't a person living around here know something? Let's show the fragments to someone and ask them about it. Oh, is this a fragment of that prickly vine? Yes, that's right. Do you know something about it? No, I don't know anything about prickly vines either. But I have something that might be helpful. Something that might be helpful? Ta-da! A universal product appraisal machine! Wow, what's that? It's a tool made by some witch. With the power of the moon, of the moonstone embedded in here, you can find out the identity of any object. Really? Then hurry up and try it! I don't usually do this for free, but since you lifted my curse, I'll do it for free this time. Wow, that's great! Alright, here it goes. What is it? Huh? Huh? What? The prickly vine fragment has disappeared. That's strange. Why did it disappear? Maybe because of a grudge against nature? No, that's not possible. This tool just shoots moonlight and analyzes the reflected light. There are no plants that just get killed by moonlight, right? A plant that gets killed by moonlight? Alright, let's get this started. The moonflower. 
People have died from reading too many books, haven't they? So much for all that confidence. I actually, I have a disease that kills me if I read too many books, you know? Stop complaining and keep searching. You've only gone through three books so far. Only? Come on, look at the size of these books. It's only too much work. Can't you read instead? You sure you want to do that? Of course. We're friends, right? Looks like the next few lines are about the moonflower. What? Really? Let's see here. Bitter grape tree. Bitter grape tea tree? That's the tree we saw at the summit. The glowing one. The glow came from the blue moon butterflies. Hmm. The tea leaves, blah, 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 blah. Tastes like grapes, strong butter taste. Oh, here it is. It's famous for its flowers, the moonflower. <gasps> oh, moonflower! So it was here! There's still more information. Hmm, it gathers moonlight most of the time, and on a moonless night, the moonflower blooms. A moonless night? So, if we get rid of the blue moon butterflies, then the moonflower will bloom! Yeah, it's a commonly used method back in Lucerne or two. Gather moonlight with the blue moon butterflies. Shoot them away and collect the moonflower. Alright, let's get rid of the blue moon butterflies, make lunar's oil, and remove the prickly vines. But, what do we use to get rid of the blue moon butterflies? They don't like sunlight, so a sunlight potion should work. Alright, let's make a sunlight potion and get rid of those butterflies. Concoct sunlight potion. Alright, how do we do that? Witch flower extract, maple herb extract, the two witch flower. Okay. Oh, fur, fur. I need fur. Let's go on a little adventure to go grab our things. So, we've gotten all of that that we can get, and then we're going to go over here, and we're going to grab. There we go. They ask me to- Running! Run! Oh, what? Okay. I don't know what that's going to do for me, but I'm glad that I have it. Because if I know anything about crafting things, rocks and sticks tend to be one of the most vital components. I love the music in this so much. Oh, look at my stamina. I didn't even think about that. Okay. So, sunlight potion, two witch flower, an extractor, two maple herb, and an extractor. Okay, we get all this. Set fire to stage fright five, and then right. Okay. Bunk, 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 right. There we go. Cute. Okay. The sunlight potion is ready. Let's go to the tree right away. Great, they're stuck to the tree as expected. Wow, there are tons of shining butterflies. You're going to make them all go away now, right? I feel so bad for them all of a sudden. It's for the tree's sake. Hurry and sprinkle up the hurry up and sprinkle the potion. Okay, here it goes. Look at me and Rubrum. Oh, how pretty. Wow, it's beautiful. Where are those butterflies going? Wouldn't they go back to where they came from? But the flower. Oh, over there, over there. Oh my goodness. The music is going crazy and I love it. It's so beautiful. Yes, it really, it's really, really beautiful. Now we can just pick up Moonflower and make Lunar's Oil. Rubrum, can you go to the prickly vines and wait for us there? We'll come as soon as the Moon's Oil is ready. Oh, okay. I'll be waiting in front of the vines. Okay, acquire. Acquire. Alright, let's go to the dispensary now. I should make Lunar's Oil. I can't get the rest of them? Oh, okay, goodness, they're teleporting me away. 
Ellie, I hope you haven't forgotten. For Lunar's oil, you need Phoenix Feather. There's no way we can find a Phoenix around here. We have a Phoenix Feather right here. You have told me all about it earlier. What? Oh, goodness. If we do that, we might not be able to get back on the train. We might not make it to High Lion. A witch is always ready to help, starting with the one who needs it the most. That again? You just like it here better. Well, of course. You just don't like the witch's house in High Lion. That's true. Stop being childish. You're going to regret it later. No, Virgil. What I will regret is not doing this right now. I'm sure of it. Great. I have all the ingredients now. Ellie, you're worse than Arya sometimes. Oh, please. I'm nowhere near as good as my mother. That wasn't a compliment. All right. Now, let's make Lunar's oil. One moon flower and an extractor seed to do, one phoenix feather, and add in as is. Set fire to stage one. Don't stir. Okay. Stage one. Don't stir. Okay, I got it. If I were to screw that one up, would I have soft locked the game? <laughs> a potion that emits strong moonlight. It contains the power of the moon. It's expensive due to the rare ingredients required to make it. Woohoo! The lunar's oil is ready. Let's go get rid of the prickly vines now. I'm here. Now let's hurry up and get rid of the annoying vines. Um. Huh? Did you happen to suffer somehow because of me? Don't worry about that. This was my choice. What I really wanted to do. And this is my choice. Wow. Thanks, Ellie. It's no big deal. You can come to the witch's house anytime you want. Are you going to stay here? Yeah. I think I'll keep staying here as an apprentice. Really? Really? Really. Keep up the good work, Rubrum. Rubrum? Okay, keep up the good work too, Ellie. Hurry up and go home for now. Your grandma must be worried. I'll find you later. Okay, see you in a bit. Yeah. I misjudged, Rubrum. I'm sorry. Okay, I think I've been recording for an hour, and I know that I started this and said that we were going to the village, but I didn't realize that it was going to be so incredibly difficult to go to the village. So, I think I'm going to end this episode here. I will go to sleep and save, and then we will start off next episode by going to the village. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye!